So I've been asking myself a lot in the last few days why I agreed to do this project. Um, when I was first asked um, to be a participant, I was really flattered and excited and uh, my ego felt stroked. And I had just come off of a workshop with Anne, my first workshop, which was extremely powerful for me. And I had come to really value the importance of this work and wanted to be a part of bringing this work to as many people as possible. So it was a no-brainer for me. I said yes um, and was very, very excited about the project. In the last few days, as the reality has set in about what this was going to involve, I've had a lot of anxiety and a lot of fear and a lot of doubt about um, participating. On the one hand, it feels really fun that we're all going off for six days into the you know, Santa Barbara wilderness and it's going to be like a vacation almost, it feels like. But uh, then I remember that it's actually six days of work. I'm excited. Because I don't know what's going to come of this. I don't know how this experience that all of us are going to share uh, is going to be depicted. Um, but at the same time, I like it because it's bold. I really believe that that's something to offer. <laughs> <laughs> really, I do. Uh, <laughs> something to offer. Uh, um, yeah. <laughs> something to offer the world. Hi, I'm Katie, by the way. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. I'm the, I'll be your roommate. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I don't know if you have a preference. I don't really care. I just no, kind of plot whatever. my stuff. This is fun. Okay, cool. Have you done this before? Core energetic? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. I have. I've been doing it for about a year. Oh, nice. Yeah. Have you? No, this is my first time. Oh. Maybe you can <laughs> give me some tips. <laughs> uh, go for it. Don't hold back. Okay. <laughs> I'll do my best. <laughs> So you've done this work for once before. Once before. It rocked my world. <laughs> oh goodness gracious! <laughs> <laughs> but in a good way. Yeah, yeah. I and mean, it was in a really good way. I have never done therapy, so I'm trying. Okay, I'm trying. It's awesome. I'm impressed. <laughs> no, I, I am. Christ. This, this stuff is scary. I've done it. It's not like it's not scary most of the times I go. I know you a lot better in a couple of days. Oh my gosh. <laughs> you won't want to know me anymore. <laughs> no, I'm sure I will. Uh, I'll, I'll like that guy, whoever that guy is. Unless you or, get very aggressive toward me, in which oh, case yeah. it may take a few minutes. I'll be kicking your hour. ass. <laughs> so why, why are you doing this? <laughs> it's a friend. I, I guess we'll find out. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. You know. That's exactly. I'm sure I'm here for some reason. I have no idea what to expect with the therapy. I really don't, you know. I'm going to try to go with it to it as far as I can. And I'm, I'm not afraid of being pushed into places where I don't want to be. I'm, I'm pretty good at, I'll say no if I don't want to do something, and, and, and I'll try to make myself say yes. You need to be vulnerable. <laughs> That's right. 
I suppose, yes. I'm, I'm just gonna roll with it. I'm Ann Bradney, and I'm 53, and I'm coming from Los Angeles, and I am the Core Energetics Radical Aliveness practitioner who's leading the workshop. Uh-oh, the mama. <laughs> Hi! You're the sisters I haven't met. Yeah. Hi. Hi. I'm Katie. Uh, Hi, Katie. Hi. I'm Anne. Hi, Hi I'm Sonia. I'm so glad you're here. Yeah. Yeah. It's, it's yeah. nice. It's beautiful, <laughs> huh? I've done a lot of this kind of work, and she's one of the most skilled facilitators I've ever been with. She's just a delightful person, but for me, the most important thing about Anne is um, what I call transparency. She just, I don't know, she has this deep desire and ability just to let life come through. I've had this profound experience of going from a place where I thought I was going to die, I felt I had no reason to live, to a place where I feel that life is incredibly precious and amazing, and that people are amazing, and the world is amazing, and I just have this deep desire to support others to open all the way to who they are and to bring their gifts to the world. I think what I want to say tonight is just that for those of you who have done this work and for those of you who haven't, maybe especially for those of you who haven't done this, I want to say that this work is about saying yes to all of our energy. And that that's a really intense thing to do. I mean, the reality is, most everybody all over the world keeps control of their energy. Or they lose control in horrific ways. So we have all sorts of issues about being in control and being out of control. And in this workshop, I want to say that we have all come here with an intention to say yes to our energy, that there is a very powerful group of people here who can hold whatever needs to come through, that there is nothing you can do that is wrong. There are no mistakes that you can make. There is nothing you can't say. It takes a lot of courage, A, just to do this work. I think doing this work takes courage. I want you to notice any place in your body that you feel either tension, holding, tightness, any place you're aware of, or, or just a lot of energy. It could be a lot of moving energy. So just, just notice. My legs, my legs are shaking right okay, now. Okay, put your hands right where, where your energy is. Everybody. My legs are shaking. Yeah, yeah. put your hands where your energy is. Once you find it, once you find the place where you're feeling your energy, I want you to go around and meet people again, but this time without words. You're just going to look at them, and you're just going to make contact and notice where their hands are, and, and they're going to notice where your hands are. And notice how you feel as you take people in, just, just noticing where they're holding. Just notice what starts to happen. Close your eyes for a second. And notice if this energy that you're connected with, you know, where you have your hands, if it could speak or make a noise, what would it say or what would it sound like? It might be a sound. <laughs> Let me go. Oh, no, 
Be still. Be scared. Yeah. <laughs> that looks like a scared. That's a very scared stance. <laughs> <laughs> I wanted to start with this just because I wanted people to have an experience of what it's like to really engage from the body and to feel your energy and to feel how revealing and open it is to connect to it and to let it speak and how different that is from the way in certain ways <coughs> we normally function. Uh, jump up and down for a second. <laughs> If there's something you need, ask for it. If there's something you want to give, give it. If there's something you want to risk, risk it. Just really practice seeing what it's like to just do what you need and want to do in the world. And then whatever comes up, we'll deal with it, okay? I want to ask if, if there's anybody that needs or wants to say something before we close for the night. Is anybody not okay or needing something? Yeah, I want to say that my uh, throat's really tight. My face is like super tight and I feel like shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and it's not funny. I mean, yeah, I feel like you shit. You don't feel good. I don't feel good. and. Uh, just breathe for a second. I think it's really great that you're saying it and that you're not walking out of the room feeling terrible. Well. And just, just breathe. What do you think you need? Take a look around the room. Really? My response is nothing. and your body's starting to shake. Is there anybody in the room you feel safe with? Yeah, a number of people, I guess. Would you be willing to tell them who they are and let them just come a little closer to support you for a minute? Yeah. Yeah, take some deep breaths. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Let me ask you something, Mike. Yeah. Open your eyes and look at us. Just let us see you in this place and see the you don't have to go away feeling like shit. <laughs> Are there a couple of words that go with all that feeling? Is there a statement? Help me. Great, say it. Help me. Help me. Say it again. Help me. You guys just Please help me. notice how it feels, and if something comes up for you, say it Please out. Help me. I say okay. It's okay. Can we come closer, Mike? Yeah, if you want to. <clears throat> Close the circle in connection with Mike and um, just be with him and be with each other and feel this. First night. <sighs> oh. It looked like that could almost be a smile. <laughs> <laughs> and this 
is leadership. This is leadership. It's just showing up and speaking the truth and being willing to let others see that. Thank all of you. Mm -hmm. Thanks. Thank you. Thank you.